You always have such creative ideas, and today is all about Mayflowers. Yes, Mayflowers. Last month we did some weather-related stuff, and now it's time for the fun sunshine and flower <laughs> stuff. Okay. Um, first, we have hydrangea art, and that is made with bubble paint. Would you like to give it a try, Nolan? Sure. Which you said you're, you're not extremely crafty, but this sounds like fun. It's basically bubbles, it's right? It's more of an activity, this is, and it's so easy. You can actually buy bubble paint, but it's more fun to make. It's okay. made with one part paint, one part dish, dish soap, and then two parts water. Okay. So okay. you're going to try blowing into this. And I put it in a pie pan because it's nice and shallow. Okay. So we want to get those bubbles up pretty high to make a nice print. Oh, this is fun. You're doing great, Nolan. Okay, let's try it right about then. Okay. okay. Oh, that's awesome. Let's see. So just place the paper on top of the right. bubbles without popping yes, them, right? Yes, very the... carefully, very gently. Oh, nice. Let's see if, is it making a print? Can you tell? I think so. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yay! Oh, cool. Yay! And so the little bubbles will soak into the paper mm -hmm. and make nice little hydrangea flowers. And you can add leaves by painting them or okay. cutting them out with paper. Awesome. Great work. have some more paint here. Yes, these are our little um, hyacinths. Mm -hmm. Um, made with bottle caps. So just take a little recycled bottle, make sure the top is screwed on really well, and just squirt some paint on a paper plate and stamp. And this is actually a really good activity for toddlers too. I was gonna say, young kids yeah. could actually use this. And it's really easy to control, you know, a stamp this large. <laughs> so, right. So, um, and then next we have our dandelion. Oh, this is cool. Okay. And take the fork, take the fork dip and it paint at your paintbrush. Yes. Okay. And it's really exciting for kids yeah. to paint kind of in a non-traditional way with household items. Yeah. yeah, Nolan said household items. Hopefully you have these right. Hopefully yes, we were talking dish about soap. dish soap. We're yeah. like, we hope people have dish soap at their homes. Water um, bottles. But you want to make sure this solution is non-toxic because sometimes younger kiddos forget okay. and kind of inhale instead of exhale, so beware be of that, okay. yes. I'm glad you did not, thank you, you're a great helper. Thank you so much for coming on, these are great. Thank and you. You can find more of their craft ideas on the website at yeah. Tyler Ross. It's always fun to be here. Well, we love having you, very creative.